Okay, so in this tutorial, we are going to take a look at how to add uh, jQuery to our Ionic project. This has been a problem for many developers, so I decided to make a video on it. So first of all, we have to install jQuery using npm uh, into our de dependencies and also install the type uh, definitions for jQuery, which will be npm install um, at types slash jQuery dash d. All right, so let's install that one as well. The next thing to do is to make uh, do some configuration so that jQuery will be copied when the project is building be copied into our assets folder so we don't manually do it ourselves so we have to create a copy.config.js file that's where the configuration for copying will be and then we have to uh, uh, tell the package.json uh, inform it about this file so we're going to tell it that doing, when doing ionic copy it should use the uh, copy.config.js file and, and do the co copy the, 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 the stuff inside it. So where do we find a, a template for, for this? Well, let's go into our node modules and inside our Ionic uh, directory, you will see the app scripts and we will, you will see the configurations that we have the copy.config config, so we can copy the stuff here and put it inside ours and then add the the one for our jQuery as well so let's change it to copy jQuery all right and then we have to give it the uh, source file, the patch to the jQuery uh, file. So let's look for it inside our node modules, jQuery, we have found it, and inside we have the disk, and then we have the jQuery. So let's tell it that if you go to node modules, slash jQuery, slash j, your dist, dist, slash jQuery.js and we want to copy this into uh, our asset folder so we copy the ww slash asset and uh, replace it with the build and that is it now we have to reference the jQuery that to be copied so let's go into our index.html uh, file and reference it so let's uh, add it here under the vendor reference so all right change it to asset slash jQuery since the um, configuration specified that that's where it should copy jQuery to so now we have jQuery. How do we use it? Before we can use it, we have to tell TypeScript that there is something called jQuery and also the dollar sign. Okay, so let's add the dollar sign as well as a reference. So we can use it. So we're going to implement a toggle function. And this toggle function will use jQuery to uh, hide or, or show uh, any element uh, with the class title. So we are going to use the slide toggle function of jQuery, which add some animation to it all right uh, now let's go into a home 
page uh, HTML file and let's add a, a p tag with a class title and add some text to it then we will uh, add a button that will fire or uh, uh, yeah fire the toggle function that we implemented in our class all right so that is it the uh, toggle okay so now let's well we have been told that uh, jQuery cannot be found because uh, we just did a live reload, so let's cancel everything and uh, start all over and accept for the copy to take place. Okay. Alright. Okay. It also looks like uh, we don't have any text on our button, so let's go and add it to it. Let's add a text uh, toggle so we can know what it will do when we click on it. Alright, so that's it. It has been uh, set, but it looks like uh, the, the text did not appear because we did it late. So let's refresh. Alright, so there we go. Now let's click and see. Alright jQuery in action, so the, the, the toggle is, is, is working, but it looks like uh, our uh, tit Ion title has a class, a title, so it, it's also taking effect, yeah. so that is it, that is how to add jQuery to Ion link.